So, if you look in the Musaf of Rosh Chodesh, there's a paragraph over there where the Chachamim were mitakin, 12 phrases of bracha corresponding to the 12 months of the year. There's 12 of them. Now, on a leap year, Shana Me'obirit, like we had this year, they add a 13th phrase. If you look at the end, Urchaparat Pesha. Okay? Now, there's a machloket in Minhagim, the Kafachaim brings down, how long do you say that 13th phrase for? We know that a leap year goes the entire year, from Rosh Hashanah to the next Rosh Hashanah. How long do you say that phrase, Urchaparat Pesha? The Kafachaim brings down three Minhagim. Minhag number one is the entire year. Entire year, meaning Rosh Hashanah, you don't say it because we don't say that those phrases on Rosh Hashanah, but from Marcheshvan until the next Rosh Hashanah, you say it straight. One minhag. Minhag number two is that you say it from Rosh Hashanah until Chodesh Nisan. Why? The leap month. What's the leap month? What's the Chodesh Ha'ibur? That's Adar Hashani. After Adar Hashani, it's not noticeable as a leap year anymore. So from Chodesh Nisan already, you stop. And then there's a third shita that he brings down, is to say it only on the leap month. You only say it by Musaf of Adar Hashani, and that's it. No other months of the year. Now, most of the, uh, the poskim don't hold like the third minhag. There's a difference though, there's machloket. What do we do? It seems from the Ben Yishai and other poskim, like the first opinion. All year long, from Rosh Hashanah to Rosh Hashanah. Nevertheless, the minhag of Maran Zechonon Lebracha, and if you look in Siduri Chavedat, it says that that's what he did as well, is to stop at Chodesh Nisan. He already stopped with Chaparat Pesha over there because it's not noticeable anymore. Since the Chodesh Aibur, Adar Hashani already passed, from Chodesh Nisan and on until Rosh Hashanah, you already do not say it. Again, Elu Ba'elu, Divrei Elohim Chaim, it's not Me'akev the Tefillah whatsoever, it's just Chiluke Minhagim, it's not a big deal. Either which way you do it, you are Yotze, Yedechova, Yom Tov, and Chodesh